Hey guys, it's your girl Aubrey, and I'm back with another video for you guys. If you are new here, hello, my name is Ari, as I said. Before the video begins, I just want to say thank you for all the love and support that I got on my last video. Keep running it up, keep liking, commenting, and subscribing, all the good stuff. So today, we'll be revealing my room tour, my fabulous, my luxurious room tour. This is the room, this is the biggest room I've ever had. So I'm pretty excited to show y'all. And side note, the room is not finished yet. With me living on campus and at home, it takes longer for me to furnish it. But right now it's looking golden. So we finna get into it. And I also wanna say that this video will have two parts. One part is my room tour during the day. And then one part will be the room tour at night. Because I have several sources of lighting in my room that I use when it's dark and not just the lighting that came with the house so i want you guys to see my room in that perspective when it's dark so without further ado let's get into the video so when you walk up the steps in my house what you see is my room door and my bathroom um i'm not really going to go into the bathroom because there's nothing really spectacular about it but i do have my shoe closet in my bathroom but my shoes are at my door so what you see when you open my door first is my wall with my lights. So this is what it looks like. It's a high ceiling, but this is what you see first. And then I have my Crocs down there. overview of my room. This is what you see when you first walk in. Overview of the room. I'm gonna go in depth where I got things, why I got things, how much were some things, and yeah, just to give y'all a really in depth room tour that again is not finished. So, to start back off with this wall, I actually got this wallpaper from Amazon. Um, this is the wall, same wallpaper that's over there, as you can see. I got this wallpaper from Amazon, and me and my mom put it up, and I got this leather from Hobby Lobby and then I just added some glitter and some pink paint around it just because it's the first letter of my name. These lights actually came from five and below. So yeah, these are actually two strands and then you connect them at the top if you can see. You connect them and then it makes a longer strand. So I got those from five and below. I think they're like $3 honestly. So next is this chair. This is so comfortable. Like this chair looks small, but I swear it's the most comfortable small chair ever. 
Um, I'm not sure where my mom got this. I was at the dorm when she said she got it, so I just came home and it was here. But I got the pillow, this fluffy pink pillow from Walmart. And this rug came from, I believe, Ikea. It's just a circular white rug. It's really soft and my dog likes to sleep on it at night. So that's the only time he can sleep on it. I don't let him be on it during the day because obviously it's white and I want to keep it as clean as possible. So next, the desk. This desk actually came from Walmart. I mean, not Walmart. This desk came from Amazon. And this is not my final desk. This is just a temporary desk. I'm gonna get a eight drawer acrylic desk right here. And I'm gonna have this whole wall be a mirror. So that will happen probably when I move out of my dorm in May. So for now, this is the desk that I got. I have this gold pineapple that has some change in it. And I have my purse. This purse was a Christmas gift. And this came from Aldo. And then I have my computer case that has my computer charger, my Apple Watch charger, my phone charger, and the charger to my Apple mouse. And on top of my desk, I just keep my glasses, my TV remote, my favorite candle, the bright hibiscus. If you know me, you know my favorite flower is hibiscus and this candle smells amazing. But I keep my MacBook, my Apple mouse, if you get a MacBook, I highly suggest getting a mouse because sometimes having your hand like this on the trackpad can hurt. So the mouse is really good. And then I have my hydro flask. I normally just keep water in here because my room is upstairs. So going up and downstairs sometimes is just tiring. So I usually keep water in here and it's like my Clark Edition hydro flask. I got the hydro flask from the hydro flask website and then the stickers from Clark Atlanta Bookstore. And I got this plant from Ikea. You know, Ikea come in clutch with the artificial plants. And then here I just have my Apple Watch, my AirPod case, and my ring light. This is what I film all my videos with since day one. I actually need a bigger and brighter one, but you know, we are gonna work with what I gotta work with. So next we have this massive wall. And again, the wallpaper is from Amazon. And um, how do I explain it? It came on individual sheets. And then you just put the sheets together, like kind of like a puzzle. And yeah, this is how it comes off. And then my mom gave me, she gave me this from, I'm not sure because I've had this ever since eighth grade promotion. And I am now a sophomore in college. so. I'm not sure where she got that, but every move we've made, I've kept it because it really means something to me. So it is now here with, in Georgia with me. So next we're gonna go into my bedding. So my favorite part about my whole room is my bedding. Um, and it's not even just the bedding, it's like the actual bed frame. Like I love this bed frame so much, if you can see. It's like linen and it has sparkles in it. And a cool feature is this bed frame came with LED lights. If you look closely, there's a button right here. And I will show you guys, like I said, in the night part. Remember I told you guys there was gonna be two parts of the video. I will show you I will show you guys that in the night part. I'm gonna have four big pillows and one big body pillow. And I forget what this is called, but I recently just got this and I love it. And then my white bedding, I recently just changed my bedding it was black but i feel like white brings out the room more the bedding is from walmart this is from walmart this is from walmart literally everything is from walmart but my throw blanket my throw blanket is actually from target this is just a gray velvet throw blanket in case i want to nap or i get cold and i'm just watching tv i use that and i got the gray to match the wall so if you don't see the color scheme it's baby pink white and gray i have different shades of pink if you can see the curtains are a different shade of pink than this and even these two are different and that's different but any pink i love pink it's not my favorite color but i do love pink so next the shelving this shelving actually came from five and below as well the candle holders came from amazon these 
came from Amazon as well. These weren't together. I just put them together. And you're supposed to put a candle inside of there, like a fake one. But I don't have any yet, so they're just empty. But I put that together right there. And then I have one also up there, if you can see it. So yeah, I recently added that to my room. And I just think it's really, really cute. The gold too. I also have gold in my room. But I don't have a lot of it yet. So to give you guys another perspective, if you're laying down, this is what you see. That's my closet. My TV is playing Destiny's Child, Pandora Nose. The chair and the desk, the front door. And this painting, I didn't talk about this painting, but this painting actually was the first piece I bought for my room. And it came from Burlington. And it has all the colors I want, the gray, the gold, and the pink. As you guys can see and it has like textured so yeah it's really really big but yeah this is just the perspective and then these these are kind of like my lanterns for my room my mom made them for me um you're supposed to put the can oh you can see it put the candle inside and light them up but unfortunately those are dead so in the part two i won't be able to turn them on but they actually twist and turn and then the light comes on and then at night it's a whole different vibe but this is the overview of my room so like i said guys this is not my finished room i still have a lot more to do with this room but because i live on campus and i live at home it's kind of harder for me to, you know, furnish this room when most of my time I'm at the dorm. I usually come home on weekends, but sometimes I don't. So again, it's just um, not that really consistent of living here until I move out in May. Once I move out in May, I will have this room furnished before I go back in August. And then we can do the completed room tour and the completed house tour. Cause I know you'll want to see the rest of the house. If y'all knew how my mama decorated, y'all would want the house tour ASAP. Okay, so it's much later in the day. So again, I just wanted to show y'all what my room looks like when it is nighttime and the LED bed feature that I have on my bed. So let's get into the last part of the room tour. So this is the overview of my room, what it looks like at night. Again, I don't use this light. I just use this one, the ring light and my bed light. And the lights that y'all seen over here earlier fell, so I gotta redo that, but this is the vibe of the room at night. I just want to show you the light feature. So this little button right here is where you press and then the lights come on. And it's just a light press, like you barely could touch it. And then the lights go all the way around. that is it that is it for the room tour again my room is not furnished with me living in two different places it's kind of harder for me to furnish my room but it will be furnished by august but yeah now that y'all see how i'm living and what the room is looking like i hope you guys like that i hope you guys enjoyed it and hit the like button if you did comment anything you want 
subscribe however you want just make sure it's at the end of the video and yeah i will see y'all in the next video